and welcome to American Dream Selling Seattle Edition. I'm Reba Haas, your host, and today I am super stoked to show you what this show is all about of lifestyle, culture, and real estate. We're gonna be on my friend Jay Irons' boat, where we're gonna leave from Leshai here, head to the south end of Lake Washington, visit the amazing restaurant Anchovies and Salt, the largest Vietnamese restaurant outside of Vietnam. And then we're gonna head around the tip of Mercer Island to go see this amazing house that is a boat that's a house, but not a houseboat. So I am very excited to introduce to all of you Quinn Fan, owner and proprietor of Anchovies and Salt, an amazing Vietnamese restaurant here in Renton. First, I want to let our viewers know a little bit about the restaurant itself and how it got started. So give us a little background. Well, this is a 20 years dream. Uh, I just wanted to share like everything about my culture with Seattle. The food, the geography, the people, it's just the history. You know, I mm -hmm. want to put all of that in one wholesome experience. You're providing an experience that nobody really has had. Our restaurant is intentional in building out southern, central, north Vietnam, okay. and our food follows the same roadmap. We want it to make people see the nostalgia that they, they've missed or, or they can experience a new nostalgia that they would entice them enough to visit Vietnam itself. Uh, even in a bar, our drinks are crafted from in Vietnam. We source everything out of there, and a Vietnamese gin and tonic is probably one of the best drinks, and it's one of the first liqueur to ever make it out of Vietnam. You have the Imperial Palace on a big print over here, and then you mentioned to me there's details throughout the restaurant where you're kind of taking elements from that and showing it off. It was very intentional to share the architectural side and also the cultural side of, mm -hmm. of what Vietnam is all about, right? So mm -hmm. that, the, the design on, on all of this is meant to, to resonate. It looks mm -hmm. ancient in a way. It could it's be also royal. warm. Exactly. We want it to be inviting. We want it yeah. to be a place where you can really relax. But I want you also to absorb a little bit of culture, right? Like. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, we're going to go and check out the rest of the restaurant right now. And again, Quinn, thank you so much. This thank has been you. such a pleasure. I'm so excited to get a chance to get this Let, in front let's, of more let's people. Let's go tour. Let's go do it. Okay, we are on the southeast portion of Mercer Island on Lake Washington, and I have with me Jay Irons of MRA General Contractor, and he's one of the partners and a good friend of mine as well. So thank you so much for being here with us today. Absolutely, happy to do it. This project began life as an actual boat. We think of it as the boathouse, um, really because that's, that's still kind of what it is. Um, mm -hmm. It resides here on the shore of Lake Washington. Um, it has been probably for the last close to a century been used as, I think, of a getaway property. Um, in fact, our clients who also live on Mercer Island uh, found the property for sale um, paddling along in their kayaks right about 20 feet away from where we're standing uh, and said, this is definitely the property for us. Walk us through what you guys did. For sure. So our, our clients uh, reached out to us and said, we want to refashion the interior to better suit our needs, which is a pretty common thing for us. We worked with an interior designer, Robin Shell Design, uh, to put together the design uh, program and the design vision for the project. And then we worked over the course of several months uh, with a group of subcontractors to uh, kind of refresh and renew the building for our clients. What for you was the most um, kind of exciting piece in working with this project? Well, I mean, for us, the you know the nature of the project is really the most exciting part of it. Mm -hmm. So the nature of coming into a boat where nothing is square or plumb mm -hmm. um, is yeah. uh, is pretty challenging for us. And yeah. being able to be a part of 
uh, a family's journey to better connect themselves to the water, mm -hmm. their story uh, yeah. is also a big part of the uh, process for us. So Jay, thank you again for doing this with us today. It was such a joy to get a chance to show off this fun boathouse and more of the lifestyle and culture down here on the south end of Lake Washington. So until next time, go out and have your American dream.